For this pulled string art, you are going to start out with some paper. You're going to take it and fold it in half so that you have a crease down the middle, just like that. And then you're also going to need some string. Dip the string into the paint. You want to make sure that the string is entirely covered in the paint. You can run your fingers down the string to sort of spread out that paint. We don't want it to drip or anything, so make sure there's not too much paint on there, but that it's coated evenly throughout the string. Next, you're going to put the string onto one side of your folded paper, and you're gonna wanna make sure that there is one part of the string hanging out from the bottom. Close the paper, and you're going to pull from the string that's hanging out from the paper. Make sure that one hand is on the paper so that it's not moving. And when you open it up, you should have your pulled string art. Now you can choose to do a second string with a second color of paint on another sheet of paper, or you can continue working on the first one that you started. You can see here that I'm adding on to the one that I've already started. Just make sure that you use a new string for each new color and that your hands are clean from your first color of paint before you dip it into the next color of paint. You can see that I'm working on my third color with my third string and I'm just going to repeat the same process that I've done with the first two strings. And if you even need help from a family member or friend, you can get them to help out as well. So once you've finished that, you should be done with your pulled string art.